five most useless megaprojects in the world. The human spirit is driven by ambition, and sometimes that ambition manifests in colossal undertakings known as megaprojects. These projects promise to revolutionize landscapes, reshape economies, and connect communities. They can be bridges spanning vast distances, dams taming mighty rivers, or stadiums hosting the world's biggest sporting events. However, the allure of mega projects often masks hidden dangers. From environmental devastation to financial mismanagement, these ventures can quickly turn into cautionary tales. This text explores five such mega projects, each a story of grand vision plagued by unforeseen challenges and unintended consequences. We'll delve into the H3 Interstate in Hawaii, a highway to nowhere, the Senate, Francis Dam disaster in California, a monument to engineering hubris, and the ghost town of Xiangyun in China, a chilling reminder of economic folly. We'll also analyze the Hong Kong Zhuhai Macau Bridge, an underused marvel of engineering, and the abandoned Amazon Stadium in Brazil, a symbol of misplaced priorities. Through these diverse examples, will gain valuable insights into the intricate dance between ambition and practicality, highlighting the importance of careful planning and responsible execution in the pursuit of progress. Mega Project 1. The Cursed H3 Interstate, Hawaii. Picture this. A winding stretch of asphalt cutting through the lush landscapes of Hawaii, costing an eye-watering dollar when three billion to construct. That's the infamous H3 Interstate a road that seems to defy logic with its staggering price tag of $80 million per mile. Spanning just 15 miles from northwest of downtown Honolulu to the Marine Corps Base Hawaii, this roadway is as controversial as it is costly. What makes the H3 interstate particularly perplexing is its isolated nature. While most interstate highways in the United States connect various states, the H3 serves only to traverse the island of Oahu. This geographical quirk has led many to question the rationale behind such an extravagant project, especially given Hawaii's remote location in the middle of the Pacific Ocean. But the controversy surrounding the H3 goes beyond its exorbitant cost. From its inception in the 1960s, the project faced fierce opposition from environmentalists and native Hawaiian activists. The construction of the interstate threatened to level vast swathes of pristine wilderness, including sacred sites significant to the indigenous population. Despite decades of protests and legal battles, construction eventually commenced in 1989, culminating in the road's completion in 1997. However, the completion of the H3 did little to quell the discontent among locals. Many still view the road with disdain believing it to be cursed due to the desecration of sacred lands during its construction. As a result, the H3 remains largely underutilized, with some residents actively avoiding it for fear of invoking the wrath of ancestral spirits. Thus, what was intended to be a symbol of progress and connectivity has instead become a cautionary tale of misplaced priorities and cultural insensitivity. Mega Project 2. St. Francis Dam Disaster, California. In the early 20th century, the burgeoning city of Los Angeles faced a pressing need for a reliable water supply to sustain its rapid growth. Enter William Mulholland, a self-taught engineer tasked with designing the St. Francis Dam, a monumental structure intended to store over 12 billion gallons of water. Completed in 1926 after a remarkably swift construction phase, the dam was hailed as an engineering marvel and a testament to human ingenuity. However, beneath its imposing facade lurked a fatal flaw. The foundation upon which the dam was built was woefully inadequate to support its immense weight. Despite early warning signs of structural instability, Mulholland dismissed concerns, assuring the public that all was well. Tragically, his assurances proved to be misplaced. In 1928, just two years after its completion, the St. Francis Dam collapsed catastrophically, unleashing a torrent of water that laid waste to everything in its path. The disaster claimed the lives of at least 431 people, making it one of the deadliest engineering failures in American history. The collapse of the St. Francis Dam 
served as a sobering reminder of the perils of unchecked hubris and the importance of thorough engineering scrutiny. It shattered the illusion of invincibility surrounding large-scale infrastructure projects, leaving a lasting impact on the field of civil engineering. Today, the ruins of the dam stand as a haunting memorial to those who perished in one of California's darkest chapters. Mega Project 3. Zhangyan Ghost Town, China. Picture a futuristic city designed for hundreds of thousands of residents, yet standing eerily empty. That's Zhangyan International in Shijiazhuang, a $3 billion development that was seized by the government after the construction company's CEO was arrested for corruption. This modern ghost town covers a sprawling 1-800 acres, complete with high-end residential zones and commercial areas that are now silent. The downfall of Zhangyan reflects a broader issue in urban planning and economic risk-taking caps, with developers and officials overestimating demand and falling into financial ruin. It's a stark reminder of how mega-projects can falter under the weight of poor management and economic misjudgments leaving massive investments to crumble into disuse. Mega Project 4. Hong Kong Zhuhai Macau Bridge, China The Hong Kong Zhuhai Macau Bridge, the longest sea crossing in the world, was built to drastically reduce travel time between three major cities. Spanning an impressive 34 miles, this $1.188 billion project was expected to be a bustling vehicular artery. However, it is grossly underused today. The bridge's limited accessibility, due to stringent permit requirements and a daily cap on vehicle crossings, severely hampers its utility. This underutilization raises questions about the foresight involved in planning and executing transportation megaprojects, especially when they involve such significant financial outlays and have a massive potential impact on local communities. Mega Project 5 The Abandoned Amazon Stadium, Brazil Built for the 2014 World Cup, the Arena da Amazonia in Manaus stands as a $300 million testament to misplaced priorities. The stadium, which required all materials to be shipped up the Amazon River at great expense, now rarely sees the football action it was designed for. Manaus, isolated deep in the Amazon rainforest, has no major local football teams that play in Brazil's upper leagues and the stadium is significantly underutilized, hosting sporadic events that barely fill a fraction of its 44-300-seat capacity. Lastly, the stories we explored today showcase the potential pitfalls of mega-projects. While ambition can be a powerful driver, neglecting crucial factors like environmental impact, community needs, and sound financial planning can lead to disastrous consequences. This has been an info burst bringing you insights into the fascinating and sometimes cautionary world of mega-projects. Join us next time for another exploration of the ever-evolving landscape of human achievement.